Hello and welcome back to my channel. In the previous video, we learned about the variables, we learned about the data types that we are having in the computer programming. And in this video, we will be learning about the data conversion. So let's uh, first go through an example and then we will uh, understand the importance of data conversion. So I'm using the Python again here. So I'm creating two variables and at the end I will, I will be printing the sum of two numbers. So print A plus B. So let's run this program. So here uh, the system is asking me to enter the first number. So here I'm entering 10 as the first number and 20 as the second number. So my result must be 30. But here I'm getting as 10 and 20. Let's do the subtraction here. Uh, the first number I'm accept entering as 10 and the second number as 5. So the difference must be 5. So, but here I'm getting an error. So this error says that you are entering the number as empty strings and now you are doing the calcul mathematical calculations on it and that's not possible. But the plus the addition of two strings is possible because this process is called concatenation and that's why we get here the we get the result 10 and 20. In the same way in computer programming whenever we are giving some input to the system the system accepts our input as string but we always are not interested in accepting the string in reading the strings for example a user want to create a calculate or user want to read the some distance value from the uh, user for example he has a car moving uh, some meters or centimeters forward according to the input given by the user here system is accepting number as integer strings so how we gonna do this we have to do the data conversion we have to convert this input in the this string type of input into integer or the floating type of input so in python we are just entering we are just typing the class of that particular data type for example integer if you are interested in reading the integers and uh, this is the first way to convert one data type into another and here is a second way for example uh, here b is still as an integer string so i have to convert b to in integer so i will be writing as int int and v in the same way you can convert to float so for example i'm just keeping this as int and now i'm doing the calculation on it enter the first number i'm entering again as 10 in the second time i'm entering 20 the result is 30 now now this will be doing the calcul all the calculation for us for example say subtraction 10 minus 5 the result is 5 in the same way division subtraction and other calculations mathematical calculations are also possible so this process is called the data conversion this is also called the data casting so this is how we are doing data conversion in python let's just open Arduino ide and write a program to convert one data type into another data type. so i'm creating a variable here for example say uh, int a and b okay void setup and in the setup function i'm just creating i'm just starting the serial communication here with a birth rate of 9600 and uh, in the void loop function void loop function i'm uh, printing the messages for the user serial dot print ln please enter first number so i will be waiting here until user enters something so while not serial dot available while not serial dot available so i will be doing nothing and in the second case while serial is available while serial dot available what i will be doing here uh, i will be reading the data in i will be reading the data and storing the data into a so for that a equal to 
serial dot read string then to convert one data type into another we have to type this int so this to int function will be converting whatever the numerical value whatever the value user has provided we are we are reading that uh, input using the function serial dot read string and uh, we will be this function to int is converting that uh, string type of data into integer type of data and we will be doing the same for our variable b and please enter second number and in place of second number i'm just using here b and serial dot print ln i'm just printing the sum of two numbers so a plus b and uh, do not forget to include the semi semicolons and uh, just run this code upload this code into your arduino here compilation is successful that means we don't we are not having any error upload is also successful now it's time to just add two numbers Please enter the first number. I'm entering first as 10. Please enter second number. I'm entering the second as 90. So, so my sum will be 100. So here I'm getting 100. For example, I'm adding 10 with 30. So my result must be 40. So this is how you are converting uh, one data type into another in uh, Arduino programming as well as in Python programming. So to convert any data type, uh, for example, to convert string to float to to float using this function you can convert your strings into float to here you get a function to float so this function will be converting your integer values into the floating point numbers and then you can do the calculation so using these two functions uh, to int and to float you can convert one data type into another and uh, this way you can do the data conversion uh, thank you so much for watching if this video was helpful for you please do not forget to subscribe 